gentlelady from Nevada, Ms. Titus, for two minutes. The gentlelady from Nevada is recognized for two minutes. Thank you, Mr. Andrews. Madam Speaker, for more than six months, I've discussed the need for health care reform with my constituents, and time and again, I heard from small business owners who are struggling to afford health care coverage. Over the last decade, the average health insurance premium has more than doubled for Nevada small businesses, and without comprehensive reform, Nevada small business health premiums are projected to again double over the next decade. And in this year alone, small businesses across the country are being hit with a 15% average increase in premiums. It's clear that the status quo is unacceptable and unsustainable. I had concerns about the earlier versions of this bill, but I am pleased that H.R. 3962 before us today is significantly improved and takes important steps to help make health insurance more affordable. I work to raise the income level at which people are assessed a health care surcharge, and the new threshold is significantly higher, up from $350,000 for couples to a million dollars. This means that 98.8% of all small all businesses will be exempt from paying any surcharge. The bill also now exempts small businesses with payrolls below $500,000 from the employer mandate. That means that 86% of all employers are exempt. And many small businesses that choose to offer insurance to their employees will be eligible for a tax credit to help offset those costs. I'm especially proud that the provision I championed to expand the health insurance exchange so that more businesses could participate was included and strengthened in this bill. This will ensure that small businesses have additional options for purchasing health insurance at a lower cost. All these improvements combined will strengthen small businesses so they will be critical engines of growth in our community. So it's time small businesses knew who really stood up for them and cared about them and their employees. I urge my colleagues to support this bill and stand up for small business. The gentleman from New Jersey reserves the gentleman.